I remembered, as if it were yesterday, me and me mates were off the Isla Dentata. Thirty miles off the coast, to be exact. About two miles from the Devil's Triangle, when the she-devil of the sea started churning and moaning, and lightning and thunder came down like God's own fury. Yar, me buckos and I had been drinking the grog when we saw swirling out of the deeps the very same flying Dutchman. We were confused. We thought it was just a legend. We were wrong. All of a sudden, old Squidhead himself was on me ship. I looked at him and his squid lips kept quivering like he was about to cry. So I asked him, Oh, Davy Jones, you gonna squirt a little? You gonna squirt some for daddy? And that's how I wound up in the locker. I was armed with me own trusty, mystical dagger some hoodoo priestess had given me. I knew he was just mad because some womanly elf boy had stolen his key. But that didn't matter none to me. I had to look out for me own. I was the saltiest of sea dogs, and no scurvy landlubber would ever dare say different. So I planned me escape. What I did was, I used the coral at the bottom of the locker to pry open the locker as if it were a physical thing. Oh yes, the locker exists and it's about 8 by 10. I tell you what, it's not the best place to be. No, yar. <laughs> Anyhow, Anywho, anyway, I, uh, kind of swam up afterwards. It was kind of a really boring story after that. I mean, I fought some fishies and some dolphins, you know, some some sharks I may have fought, but, uh, I had a good dagger and really took care of them all, really. I mean, you, you don't need to be an expert in fighting fish with daggers to fight fish with daggers. It just sort of happens. Honestly, I, I think anyone could do it. Uh, yar. And, um, yeah. So there I was, fighting the fish and the daggers, and I got back to the surface. And me ship was gone. I was ready to blow off me cannon. I guess that's pirate slang for get mad. Get really angry. Get ticked off, you know? Well, I did get ticked off, because it was my ship. There was no reason for him to take it from me. I just made fun of him a little bit. He should really know how to take a little jiving, ribbing, and all that kind of stuff. Can't take a joke, that David Jones. I guess I would have been worse off if I called him a monkey, but I didn't call him a monkey. I just asked if he was going to cry. He looks like he's going to cry a lot. If you know him like I know him, you'd know that, right? Yeah. But, uh, yeah, anyhow, uh, I started swimming towards where I thought I should go. I mean, I know Davy Jones can't go on land, so he's probably going to go further out into the Devil's Triangle. Look, who's telling the story here? You or me? Shut up. Let me finish. Anyway, eventually, after three days at sea, I found me ship. Me mates were there. We all had a good laugh. And we drank some more grog. Davy Jones was there, too. He said he might have overreacted a little bit. I said, I, you did, Davy Jones, you did. He said, well, I already apologized. If you're going to be a jerk about it, let's just drop the whole thing. And I said, no, look, man, you threw me in your locker, okay? It's not like, uh, you know, you just, like, sort of punched me and gave me a black eye. That's, that's understandable. I'm a pirate. I get a black eye all the time. That's why I wear an eye patch, even though I'm not blind. But you friggin' threw me in the locker, man. That's, that's a little more than just, oh, hey, it's just a little friendly joke. I mean, look, you do look like you're gonna cry a lot. I'm sorry. I, I have to say it, you do look like a crybaby. And he said, oh, you blubbering gangplanker. You better not be ready to taunt me no more, or you're going to be walking the plank. And I said, 
what? And go back to the locker, and he said, yeah, that's what I need. And I said, look, pal, you can put me back in the locker all day. I got out of it once, I can get out of it again. It's not that good a locker. Maybe you should get a lock on it. And he said, stop making fun of me. And I said, no, because you just, you just asking for it now, really. You took my crew and my ship all this way, and now you're just being a jerk about things, and I'm just tired of it, really. Maybe you should walk the plank, Davy Jones. Nobody wants you here. And he said, is that true, guys? And all me mates said, yeah, it's kind of true, Davy Jones. I mean, you smell like a squid, and you look pretty bad, too, and... You're kind of a jerk. I mean, Bill here just lost his wife, and you laughed at him, and then you get all sensitive when people make fun of you. So, what? what's the deal, Davy Jones? And he said, fine, I'll go. You guys are suckers anyway. I'm going to get my own party, both blackjack and hookers. And we said, well, you can't get any hookers because you can't go on land, now can you? And he said, well, I guess I could get some lampreys. They suck at me. And we said, we don't want to know about that. You jerk, just get off our ship. And that was the story of how I fought Davy Jones and lived to tell the tale. All right, guys. Well, uh, Pirate Man Speed. Um, voting options are the same minus Pirate Man. Also, we got Remote Mine. Yar. Yep, that's pretty much it for this video. Buddies. Hey, guys. Hey, buddies. So, uh, hmm. Uh, let's not say it for now. Let's, you know, do the mouse cursor thingy. Ugh. Uh, yeah, all those options are the same. I like this stage select screen because it looks like, you know, you're actually fighting for ground instead of just teleporting in, even though you just do just teleport in. Oh, our CD, we got Venus, and King also listens to, uh, Ace of Base. I'll be recollecting all the CDs I've already collected before, but not right now. Oh, we got new parts! Yay! We can get new parts, even though we don't have bolts to afford anything yet. Because we haven't gone to Big Bolt Central yet, but we will. If you want me to, I'll do it next video. That way you can vote on some parts. You know, we got all these that are the same. Whatever. We got the enemy analyzer, which tells you its weakness. Whatever. We got the super recover, which makes pellets do things better. Yeah, you guys probably won't vote for that. Counterattacker makes you stronger when you're weak. Auto charge makes it so you don't have to charge up your buster anymore. It'll just charge up by itself. Eddie, yeah, you know who Eddie is. And rush search, which he'll look for CDs. And he'll dig them up. Okay. Well, that's it. See ya.